Hello everybody, welcome back to the Mega Modded Dead Cod Plus series. We are jumping in again, trying to actually redeem ourselves and get a singular, a literal singular win. Have we played a Samson recently? I don't remember. We have, uh, but we'll play as him anyways. Why the, why the hell not? Let's jump on in and just see if we can actually do well this time. Because yeah, I've been playing um, for some reason real hecking bad and it's been real hecking sad. So anyways, we're just jumping in and hoping for the best. But I do apologize that I am a little bit ill at the moment. You might be able to hear it in my voice, but I've... Ooh, this could be good. This could be good. That is very good. Adam's Rib is a really fun item that is going to up our damage by a good amount. So I'm very happy to have that. Basically, a fair shot is going to drop a, a knife down on enemies that does a pretty good amount of damage. I think it does two times our tier damage. So it's like, basically, we hit an enemy with a fly every single time we hit it for the first time. And it has a slight amount of AoE that can actually trigger the next uh, knife too. So, pretty, pretty good stuff. It's definitely going to help in the early game, as you're seeing. It's a really fun little animation for the item as well. But yeah, um, I'm a little bit ill at the moment. I've literally just got a flu or something. I don't know what the hell it is, but... It's unfortunate, but at the minute I'm in like the, the stage of being dosed up enough on medicine that I'm feeling good enough to record. So recording just kind of generally makes me feel a bit better just because it means that I'm doing something actively. So I apologize if my voice sounds a little bit off compared to normal, but otherwise we are having a good time. And on the on the subject related, what is what was the last time you were ill and what was it? What was the last time you were ill and what was it? After, before this, for me, it was actually COVID, which I didn't actually have it too bad. Um, what's this? Changes movement pattern randomly upon entering a new room. Shoots electricity. Ooh, interesting. I like the idea of this little fella. So he's just going to randomly move. Oh, okay. So he, he quite literally is... Ah, oh, this is cool. He's kind of like a Jacob's Ladder style Tech Zero sort of dude. And yeah, he literally just, just moved randomly around the room. I like that a lot. Ooh. Any activist Adam's rib too? Okay, this could be a really good little combo actually. Um, yeah, it was COVID. I didn't actually end up having COVID all too badly to be honest, but it was still still not great. I've had a few sort of weird up and down illnesses in my life. That was interesting. <laughs> yeah, I've had a few sort of weird up and down in, uh, illnesses in my life. When I was really young, I had like really bad tonsillitis a few times, so... Uh, I never got my tonsils removed, surprisingly. Normally, when you have bad tonsillitis, they remove your tonsils, especially in the earlier days. They don't do that as much anymore, but they used to. Oh, does the Adam Trip thing destroy rocks, too? Apparently, it does. Um, but yeah, uh, so I had to deal with that when I was younger, but obviously, I don't really remember any of that. But then, like, sort of throughout, I, I think I had it in uh, college, and then once in, like, the first year of university. I'd actually mind getting hit here, because we've got red hearts to play around with. Um, I actually had this weird weird issue that I've not experienced before. Ooh, getting a single extra penny here would be really nice. So do you know what? I know one bomb for this isn't particularly worth it. Especially considering we were so close to getting it before. I'm just going to take it and uh, grab the soul heart. I'm just, I'll, I'll just be a little more confident if we had the soul heart. Really interesting that this Robo Baby thing like changes how it moves each room. I like that a lot. I think that's an interesting little mechanic. Whoa. He does some strange movements though. Ooh, we got... um. This guy, of course, Adam's rib. Not very useful here. That was a complete lie by me then. Uh, Perthro, Anzus. Okay, so I guess we just pop Anzus. Um, and then this is double Perthro. I doubt we'll get used out of double Perthro, but we can at least carry one. Um, yeah. I was going to say, absolutely useless on this boss. It only hit for a small amount of damage. And then it just annihilated him. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Turtle baby locked in a cage. Now that is something that is extremely upsetting to see. Uh, I'm trying to think if there's any way we can get that. I mean, this secret room could contain a bunch of money, uh, which would be helpful. But I don't, I'm going to guess that it won't. <laughs> So there's enemies, which I don't really know what that means for us, to be honest. Uh, yeah, Adam's rib is just so good. <laughs> okay. Um, wasn't expecting an epic fetus run here, but we now have one. Oh, speed down's kind of annoying. I was tempted to re-roll that a few times, but honestly, I haven't done an epic fetus run in so long. And I realize it can be a little lacking in synergies here and there. But overall, 
an item that I really, really like. So let's uh, let's move on. That was quite lucky. That was quite lucky. And I think, um, obviously, we'll leave one pair through. I will go down to the downpour here to start out. Um, ooh, we can get one, one player. A single player turtle baby. And you best know I'm going to try it. This, this will succeed. Guaranteed 100%. Cannot fail. Mainly cannot fail because I don't want it to fail, so... Cannot fail. Will guaranteed grab it. Damn you. <laughs> Die, turtle baby. Ooh, also, um, one thing I should do while we're here, and it's actually kind of stupid that I destroyed that thinking about it now, because we, we can destroy the keepers that are about the floor. Okay, nothing from those. Yeah, um, we can destroy the keepers that are about the floor. I realize this is taking some time, but I'm kind of fine with it. But what I was saying was I kind of had, like, weird um, issues. Do you know what? I don't really need actual bombs here, so let's uh, let's play this dude and see if we can get a bomb upgrade. Yeah. <laughs> that was pretty great. Does that work with this? I never remember. It does. Ooh. Ooh, baby. That was perfect. A single bomb for that. Um, What I was going to say is, yeah, I kind of had this weird issue throughout college where I had, like, really bad, like, stomach pain. And I never figured out, like, I went into hospital with it twice. And one time I was in there for, like, a week. And I was on, like, codeine. And I have, I have talked about this a little bit on the channel before. But never they never figured out what it was. Never figured out what it was. I'm, to be fair, I'm a little bit, not not much, but I'm a little bit of a hypochondriac. Like, I I wouldn't say to the extreme. I know, I know some people can be really worried about their health. If you don't know what hypochondriac is, it's essentially someone that's constantly worried about their health or constantly thinks they have ailments that they don't. Um, and yeah, it essentially means that they're going to be like constantly going to the doctors for various things and constantly worrying that they have issues that they don't. And I don't really have that really to the point where I'm like thinking I have issues that I don't actually have, but more so to the point... Um, Six rotten hearts and half a black heart. It'll use the half black heart, but honestly, getting a bunch of rotten hearts here is kind of an interesting deal because it's going to be lots of Adam's rib triggers, right? I kind of like the way it fires a rocket and then fires a knife down straight after. That's kind of funny. I like it. Yeah, and it just, it was a, it was an issue that I had a lot of trouble with and never figured out what it was. And it was, it was a real pain in the ass. Um, I think it was stress related because personally, I don't know what other people are like, but I don't really experience stress in a normal way. We've got the pill crusher here. Because a random pill uh, when picked up, increased pill drop rate and while held, uh, while held, consumes currently held pill and applies an effect to the entire room depending on the pill type. That could be a really fun little play style there. Might try that out. See if we can get some money out of these. At the, at the minute, I really just want more bomb upgrades, because the bomb upgrades we've got right now are pretty fun. Um, yeah, uh, and it was, it was really just very frustrating, because I didn't know what the hell was going on, and the doctors didn't know what the hell was going on, and I didn't know how to solve it. Okay, please don't get hit here, because I do not want my uh, rotten hearts being a problem. But, uh, I know I keep going back and forth between talking about this topic and talking about the in-game stuff that's going on, but I really like the idea of having these flies from Rotten Hearts because it's giving us a way to attack enemies prior to um, prior to us having... Ooh, that's... I will do that. I will do just one of that. I know we lose a Rotten Heart for that, but that's fine. Uh, it gives us a way of attacking enemies prior to our missile coming down if it takes a little bit long. Ace of Cups. What's, what's Ace of Cups again? Into friendly dips, that's kind of okay. Um, okay, I don't think we're going to be able to afford Pill Crusher, unfortunately. Okay, my electric baby is doing work right now. I don't know if any of you have ever had an illness like that or a problem like that, where you just kind of, you have it and you have absolutely no idea why. I will check this. Um, I think Time Gal is, is well worth the cost of doing business here, considering. Time Gal, we've proven time and time again, is, is very, very good. Um, and kind of overpowered, honestly. Uh, I maybe should... I don't know. I'm going to pair throw this. Yeah, unfortunately not very good. I was like, maybe we'll get some good out of it. Uh, I really think I should try and get... Um, ooh, 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 ooh. Try and get the, enough money here to get Pill Crusher, because I really do want it. 
Let's just go back and see if there's any other poops that we can uh, mess around with. And I'll take this. Ace of Cups seems like an interesting one to carry with us. Okay. What I'm liking, what, what I'd like right now is uh, flight. What well, something that I should be doing really is checking for secret rooms. I, for some reason, have not been doing that, and uh, it's quite literally free right now. So there's our money already for Pill Crusher. And there's a little bit more as well. Second secret room's a little bit harder here. Yeah, Pill Crusher's something interesting. It's actually an item that uh, was proposed but never added to the game. Oh, wait, did it drop a pill on us picking it up too? It did. Okay. Do we need to know the pill for it to work? I don't think so. I'm just going to check this. And check this. There you go. That's a lot of keys, my dude. That's a lot of keys. Okay, this has put us in a good position here. Good position indeed. So, not to not to claim too early, but I think that a win is definitely far more likely on this episode than it has been on any of the prior ones. I do want to try and see how this pill crusher ends up working out for us. I'd rather take Child's Heart right now, to be honest. Petrified Poop is good, but it's going to kind of fade off a little bit. I'm trying to think of any other things. I did I did break my collarbone once. Um, that 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 was kind of a weird one. I have covered that a little bit on the channel before. I have spoken about it a little, but essentially that was like a really weird situation. So for those of you that don't know, breaking your collarbone is like a pretty unlikely incident. Um, essentially, it's one of the hardest bones in the body to break and one of the longest to heal, and it's normally almost exclusively. Uh, tied to sports injuries. Um, what the hell? Is there any way I can get to that? Unfortunately, adrenaline really isn't what we need here, but I'll take it. Yeah, I don't think there's any way for us to get to that. Unless, uh, maybe maybe if you're smaller, you can get to it. I would like Freezer Baby, though. Um, yeah, uh, I, it's one of those injuries that I shouldn't have ever gotten. I don't really know how I did, but I ended up getting it by fainting in my friend's garden. I literally just cycled to his house too fast on the way to school and like got to his house and then just fainted. There was obviously something else going on, but they didn't really know what it was. I, I thought it might be because I didn't have breakfast, but it's like I don't have breakfast any morning, or at least I didn't used to, so I don't know if it was that. Also, use the pill crusher, you fool. I keep forgetting about it. Use the pill crusher. Use it. Okay, that gave us a trinket, and it's a trinket I quite like. I don't know if that's what crushing the pill did for us there. Let's go grab that other pill. I don't know if there's like a, a way for us to know what the crushed pill effect does. And I don't know if it makes any difference whether we know the pill or not. Yeah, I'm not actually sure. If, we, if we've if we used the pill already, does it give us different effects? Ooh, yes, please. That is very, very nice. It's definitely showing that we are getting more pills throughout here. There's more dropping, definitely. Ooh, baby, I love a cell heart. We've also got our item room to go to as well. And yeah, that, that was that was difficult. That definitely, like, that's the only burn I've ever broken. It was the first burn I broke, obviously, if it's the only one. Um, and yeah, it was kind of difficult because, like I said, I hadn't broken one before, so I wasn't really used to it. But also, with it being like a long healing one, it kind of did me in for a while. Ooh. Ooh. I don't know how these interact. Do, does it? Does it? It definitely does affect the explosion damage, right? But how? That seems like it could be really good or really bad. Secret room there. Hmm. It definitely seems like the explosion size is bigger. Uh, my Adam's knife destroyed the reroll machine. Let's let's just see if we do it all the way to the side of the room. The explosion still seems huge no matter where. So maybe this is just an, a, an outright positive. He's eternal. Okay, it seems like an outright positive. I, I, I'm going to be honest. <laughs> it seems like a positive through and through. I'm pretty happy with that. But yeah, so, like, I do remember it, like, pretty pretty well. Like I said, with it being my only burn broken, it's one of the most painful ones to break and stuff. It, it was... Pr I've got a pretty vivid memory of it. Um, and I do remember... Like, one, one thing specifically I remember is... Well, actually, there's a few things. So, one thing I do remember quite quite vividly is that I was really kind of annoyed that it happened and 
in pain, but I was actually kind of happy at the same time. Because if I remember correctly, I'm just going to blow up all of these. If I remember correctly, it actually got me out of a religious educations exam and I never had to do it. And I was like, hell yeah. <laughs> religious education is such bollocks. Uh, at least it was in my school anyways. It, it was basically like, religious education. We're going to teach you about basically nothing. We're going to give you very vague ideas and you're going to watch a film every now and again. It's like the films were nice, but everything else about it was just very dull. Um, I don't know if it's like that in every school, but it was not an enjoyable subject in my experience at all. Holy shit, Proptosis with this is nuts. Okay, that just killed everything. I'm liking Pill Crusher so far, I can tell you that much. Ah, this is cool. Okay, that was that only made them small for a tiny, tiny amount of time there, but... I can't believe how Proptosis works with this. I did not think... I thought it would genuinely mess us up and be like really low damage at long range. A Pride's back again. For Pride Month, we have to take Pride Badge every single time we see it. We cannot leave it alone. He has to come with us. Teratogenesis. I love that one, where it just kills everything in the entire room. It seems kind of like basically giving pills, like making pills into cards, essentially. It takes up your active item slot, but it kind of makes a pill into a card. Ooh, gulpy gulpy, lovely. Pride has been gulped. Broken murder, yes, please. I like it. And we're getting so many pills as well. So many pills. And it just added bleed to everything. Bleed's really good now as well. That's nice. I am literally going to kill everything in a single hit, aren't I? This is going to be the way that this works from now on. Nice. Let's go back and... What did we leave again? We left a card somewhere and I don't remember what it was. Oh no, it was a trinket. It was a trinket. We left the, cr the cricket's leg trinket somewhere. Where the hell did we leave it? This room here? Yes. Okay. My good giddy god. This is incredible. Okay, secret room. Yes, I was really hoping it'd be there. So much money. We'll go and buy some more stuff from the shop here. Regardless of if we need it or not, we get stats for it, so. Oh god, that guy like spawned on top of me. Also, I'm loving having blood bombs too. That's really nice. <laughs> this is insane. I don't think I've ever seen uh, Dr. Feeters be this good. I'm gonna get a health up pill there as well, which we'll actually just use. And that gave us a damage upgrade for some reason. Not exactly sure why. Uh, adrenaline. Adrenaline. It's because we've got an empty heart container now, so Adrenaline gave us some damage. I was a bit confused there, I'll be honest. No items for us. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to buy this. Buy this. Oh, we get another gulp pill. Hell yes. Do you know what? We might, we might get Keeper's News from doing this. Let's blow these guys up. We didn't. We did get a lot more money. Um, Justice, why not? And then why not buy another card? Chariot. I don't really use the chariot cards all that much, but it's kind of nice to have one. I was hoping for another pill, just... I was going to say for our boss fight, but we killed our boss already. I just... It happened so fast, I forgot. Getting one more bomb upgrade here would be super nice, uh, but we're going to... Let's just quickly see if we can get secret room. Oh, that was not what I was intending to do, but it kind of worked out for us. Eternal Heart, I'll take that. I shouldn't even taken it, really. I'm going to leave the floor any second. I thought, I, I didn't realize they already had an Eternal Heart on this floor. We'll see what we end up getting here. Metal Plate's pretty nice. And spawns uh, a Swarm Fly upon taking damage. Nice. That's also pretty good. Don't need to blow up these, really. Let's just go. This is a spicy, spicy run. I can't remember which way we're going again now. Is it uh, down Dark Path? I think it's Dark Path, right? Yes, it is Dark Path. We want to try and do boss rush as well if we can manage it, uh, which I think we actually can. If we speed up a little bit on this floor, I think it's certainly plausible. And honestly, with all like the locusts and extra stuff we're creating here, that's another gulp. That is three gulps so far. That's kind of nutty. This amount of gulps is unprecedented. 
I kind of find it funny that Broken Murdom works on uh, Pride here. It's kind of making him not quite as effective because he keeps just getting lagged. Um, we don't want that. Do we want this? Okay, no, we don't. Okay, let's let's keep re-rolling. I think I'll go for that. Little baggy. It's kind of interesting. I don't think we need it, though, because we're getting more pills anyways. Um. Ooh, I'd love... Ex I, I don't... Yeah, I think I'd rather have Explorer's Instinct here. Let's try and get it. I want to try and speed up here, but... Come on. A single penny is all I need. I don't even need to kill anything. It's just the game's just doing it all for me. It's great. Yeah, I don't want to take too long here, but at the same time, I do want to get that because it gives us stats and it's very useful. Speed down. There's a penny, there's a penny. Nice. Book of Despair. Unfortunately, I mean, I'll take it because it is a book. But Book of Despair doesn't really do much for us. Because for one, we don't need Fire Rate. But for two, I, I'm actually really enjoying Pill Crusher right now. It's it's very interesting. I like the fact that it's give, giving us more pill drops as well. Because we're just getting mad amount of gulp pills. Yeah, this is really nice. It's just going to give us a lot of mapping. Uh, and also show us, like, Ultra Secret Room and stuff. Just going to speed speed us up generally. Goddamn, all the excess damage. Another gulp pill. All the excess damage triggering, um... What's it called? One second. Right, sorry about that. Um, yeah, uh, what was I saying? Oh, we've got, oh, we got eternal versions of these guys here. Ow, what the hell hit me then? I don't even know. Did I just step on the spikes that are there? Probably. I want to keep my gulp pill here. I do not want to pill smash it. Pill crush it, whatever you want to call it. Who we got here? What are the creatures that I'm attacking? I never found out. <laughs> Everything died straight away. Come on, dude. You're wasting my time here. We need to get gone. Damn, you're not actually usable for us right now. I'm just going to kill you. Okay. What the hell? My missile f fell on the metal block and, like, missed everything. I didn't realize that was something that could happen. So many bombs that we don't need, but I suppose if we get another bomb beggar, it'll be useful. Insta-kill on that boss there. Uh, we'll grab that. And I don't, th I don't actually think we need the scythe. It's more damage, but we do not really need it. There's another goal. Okay, down we go. And then we, we got to try and speed run this floor, right? We're at, yeah, we really got to speed run this floor. Just ignore everything. Unless it's something we really need, just ignore. We got a black heart there from something, I don't know what. Thank you, tech buddy. You're doing a great job. And Adam's rib, as our damage increases, so is Adam's ribs. Damage, so getting that skull item is, is very, very useful for us. Damn it, we went the wrong way. That is, that's probably locked us out of boss rush now. I'm going to quickly plop this in there. Nah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, that's probably locked us out of boss rush now, but I'll try my best to keep going. But I, I have a pretty strong feeling that we're not going to make it. The amount of gulp pills this run is insane. Because, like, the thing is, if we get to Mum, we can kill her near instantly. Ah, double wrong way. We needed Explorer's Instinct to proc a bit faster. It 
pretty much impossible unless it's like right here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So you're saying there's a chance. Dude, 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 dude. That was close. That was really close. Dark path, remember? That gives us some damage as well. That was very close. Um, I guess we take Waspel here. Eternal boys get blapped. Yeah, it seems that Proptosis just gives you a massive damage buff and, like, no downsides. <laughs> it's kind of insane. I love doing that. Getting the timing just right so it spawns and it instantly dies. It's a lot of fun. Oh, my lord. You didn't die? Oh, boss armor. I was like, why didn't you die? You got boss armor, though. That's just cheating. We do have some mini bosses about here, so we should be careful of those. Yes, the knives just insta kill all the phases. There is one more phase pootering around somewhere. Here he is. Yeah, anything that doesn't have boss armor is essentially completely fucked. Ow, that was a good hit. This guy has boss armor. You can just tell when they do, but it does make things a little more interesting. It means we're, even though we're overpowered, we're not going to insta-kill everything. I'm liking having all this blood everywhere to just be doing constant tick damage. The body is... Oh my god, I've nuked myself. Suicide King, no thanks. Damn, things are speedy. I'm having trouble keeping up. Just use all the blood. Our familiars are definitely helping as well, having these different familiars here. Reap Creep's dead already. I don't think Reap Creep had boss armor. Is that his name? Is it Reap Creep? I, I never know if I'm thinking of the wrong one or not. I think it's his sister Viz, right? I don't actually know. Who we got here? Yeah, it was sister Viz. They're dead now, but it was sister Viz at some point. They tried. But psych, you can't do nothing to me. Okay, let's just focus on dodging here. Oh yeah, good. Okay, there you are, there you are. Does this guy have boss armor too? Yes, he does. Anything that doesn't die in one hit, it's like, oh, I didn't know they had boss armor. Oh, Adam's rib, you beautiful bastard. God, some, some enemies' death animations are so long. This guy is going to be annoying, because he's I think he's eternal and he has boss armor, so... Although, Adam's rib actually... Yeah, Adam's rib is, is paying dividends there. I think we're nearly done. I do like not having the mod that tells you the waves. I used to have that, but I, I think it's nice not knowing the waves and having to try and play around that and guess a little bit. Damn it, you... Dude, stop. Why don't you just Adam's rib die like you did last time? Last wave? Yeah. The clicker is not really what I want right now. It could be interesting, but it could break everything, so I'm just going to say no for now. I'm hoping we get more uses for this gulp pill. I'm not going to carry this one around. I'm going to use the pill, the, the pill crusher, because we've been getting so many of them that I don't want to waste it sort of thing. There you go. There's another pill there already. I don't want to waste pill crusher sort of thing. By just holding one gulp pill. So we'll find more. It seems like every third room is rewarding us with a pill. There's a half. There's money in all the rooms as well. I gotta say, time gal is just obscene. It's like, basically, unless, unless your run is absolute doo-doo, you will get the extra reward 100% of the time. It's kind of crazy, really. Uh, 
There's some more pills as well, but we don't really need them. I don't want to get hurt for them, to be honest. Okay, everything else is kind of dead in its own right. Yes, 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 yes. We don't really need keys. The, the fact that everything's triggering at Adam's rib is helping a lot. Why are so many of those troll bombs? God damn it. I had to stick with this because I wanted... I wanted this chest to try and get an item out of it. Whether it'll give us an item or not, I do not know. Ooh, it did give us an item. Yes, baby. A single look upgrade. And useless stats. I might have to pause to sneeze in a moment. I apologize. We are lacking on health a little bit. At least we're getting swarm flies, though. They're helping to protect us. Nice. Territory Genesis as well for another pill crush. Yeah, I really apologize about the sniveling and that. Like I said, I am ill. I know some of you might not enjoy listening to me like this, but I, I also, for one, didn't want to not record because that'll just diminish my backlog. But also, I just enjoy recording while I'm ill. <laughs> it just takes my mind off it. It helps me just to chill out a bit. I like it. I know it's probably a lot of you are saying just get some rest and stop. I need to turn off that aggressive donation machines mod because it is cool, but it does seem to lag the hell out of the game. Both both during and after whatever it happens. Okay. So many keys that we don't need. I'm leaving chests and stuff behind. I realize some of you might find that annoying, but I really don't need them at this point. Oh, some rune shards there. Interesting. Uh, Rerolls familiar crowns gives a free upgrade if none of familiars upgraded. Ah, uh, sadly none of my familiars can be upgraded. <laughs> don't think shot speed does anything for us, right? Maybe it lets our reticle move faster? I don't actually know about that. Thank you for my little babies. No flights, we can't get them. These guys do have some boss armor, so they're not going to die instantly, but they should die pretty quick. Yeah. Power of Surf. Another one of these. Haha. -ha. We're speeding through. We are speeding through. But yeah, I can I can sort of feel now. It's been like a few hours. My, my drugs are diminishing slightly. So I might need to, after this video, go and refresh a little bit. Oh, I love the fact that this gives you an immortal heart now. Yeah, I might just go and refresh a little bit and uh, grab myself another Lem Sip or something. Lem Sip actually, I don't know if any of you have that in America or whatever, but it's like a, it's basically just like a powder that you put into water, into hot water, and it's like a, a it's it's a better way of getting uh, paracetamol when you're when you have the flu. It's like proper flu medicine. It's really good, um, and it was actually invented in my hometown, which is kind of interesting. I didn't know that for a while. I only, only recently found that out. It's not. Something that's crazy amazing or anything. It was just kind of an interesting find. LED uh, LED technology was also invented. I think I can't remember if it's LED or LCD. I think it's LED technology was also invented where I'm from, which is pretty fucking huge. Either way, I can't remember which one it is, but either way, it's it's it pretty influential on the world. Like it had a pretty big pretty big impact, which is not something you can say for many of the things that were invented in uh, where I'm from. Excuse me, mind out my way. What up, Lust? I don't know if the effect, like, is determined by the pill that we're holding for Pill Crusher. No, no, no. D100, you're interesting, but you will, unfortunately, planetarium the hell out of us. And we can't be having that right now. Oh, ho, ho. The Adam's rib visuals are just so satisfying. So satisfying. But there's so you just want to look like that one. There's just a ton of enemies around. It's just so fun. Ow. I did get hit there. Oh, I was just about to say, but I've got my immortal heart and then I immediately lost it. Oh, that already opened. Explorers didn't think to open it for, opened it for us. Honestly, on the womb, I'm not really that interested in using that. Golden Penny? I'm actually going to take this Golden Penny to its limit, just in case we get a restock machine in the hush fight. 
because we're about to fight Hush, and I'm definitely going to go for it. Because I don't think we have the Hush fight done yet. No, we don't. I want that mark. We're up to 58. We, we might be okay to stop here. Yeah, there you go. It stopped anyways. Okay, this guy is eternal. Just prepare for that. Oh, God. Holy Mantle is gone. I forgot I even had a blanket, I'll be honest. But one more of these should do it. There you go. Not too bad at all. We got an Angel Deal as well here, uh, which is... Doll Pure Body. Upgrade every non-familiar to Super with Doll's Tainted Body. Upgrade every familiar to Ultra. Ooh, okay. Doesn't exactly help us, but right now at least. But we could get something here that could make it more relevant. I don't know. We'll see. Seems like an interesting item nonetheless. I do wish that um, these chests wouldn't get rerolled by other chests. This could give us a transformation. Oh, I didn't. Okay. Fire mind. Hell yes. I think that gives us fires when we drop this down, right? Yes, it does. And three dollar bill. Hell yes. All of this is good. Just checking for crawl spaces real quick here. There you go, we got it. We got... Open all doors in the current room. Ooh. I'm going to take that, because that allows us to fight Mega Satan. Um, we will buy that. And that. No restock machine, sadly. Okay, let's fight the boss. Okay, so this guy does have boss armor, of course, but we're still doing a lot of damage to him. This is going to be pretty good going, I think. Obviously, Adam's rib won't do much here, but... Gotta remember, we've got Fire Mind doing extra damage. We've got the blood on the floor doing extra damage. Obviously, the initial bomb damage itself. I do wish that fire rate with this meant that the bomb came down a bit quicker. Like, basically, once... Like, you can move the target around at the normal amount of time, but the moment you stop moving the target, at the moment you stop interacting with it, it just comes down quicker. Because it's like, it has to wear out the rest of the timer, but I think if you have higher fire rate, the higher fire rate is, the quicker it should drop once you stop moving. Obviously, you'd have to be careful to not hit yourself doing that. Oh my god, he's almost dead already. That was, uh, very quick. That was way quicker than I was expecting, i got to be honest. Basically, didn't get, didn't get to do any of his attacks. And we did take the negative. We are going down. I hope we get the void, but honestly, uh, just getting Mega Satan done is going to be quite nice for us here. We are on Sheol now. Apparently, it's pronounced Sheol. I always thought it was just Shul, but apparently it is Sheol. That guy scared me a little bit. He was getting a bit close. And I don't really think we need to worry about a single pickup in all of this area. I think for us now, it's just a straight run to the boss. I don't know what's going on right now. There's missiles everywhere. Is there a Grimace in here that I can't see? There is. It's underneath the time, gal. You tricky bastard. It takes so long for the damn missile to come in. It's annoying. Oh, laser beam boy. We have gone the wrong way here, unfortunately. Wooden chest we should at least open. No, thank you. We definitely just want to keep... I'm try I, I know that I could be using Pill Crusher more often here. But I just want to hold my Get Out of Jail free card and don't... Like, I don't want to forget it. But I'm being a bit cautious. See, like, we've got the screw there. And it's like, I think both of those stats are relatively useless for us right now. Ooh. 
we've had trouble with this boy before, so let's uh, let's be careful here. I mean, wow. He didn't even split. Adam's rib just insta-killed him. Oh my god. Okay, our damage is obscene. I realize that the uh, boss armor stuff doesn't apply to the eternal versions of the bosses, so that's probably one reason, but even still, this is insane. I lost one heart during that. That's way better than I thought I was going to do. Right, see if we get any good devil deals here. I think Twisted Pair is a must grab, right? And we got Conjoined as well. Ooh, ooh, ooh. For some reason, this is kind of maybe bad. For some reason, the Twisted Pair um, drops. Oh, they have Herming. Okay, they have Herming and they're Herming in on Pride. I was like, what's going on? Why are they so far away? But yeah, they're Herming in on Pride for some reason, which is not great. Oh, uh, also, before I forget, let's just do that. That does still count, right? Yes, it does. Good. Yeah, so I was wondering what the hell was going on there, but it's the, the, the Twisted Pair have Herming now. So they're not really doing what we want them to. We'd definitely like some more HP before doing Mega Satan here. I'm a little apprehensive, I'll be honest. I don't know where this guy's going to come in. I'm a bit scared. Finger's kind of nice here. Oh my god. The amount of damage here is pretty nutty. Even without the missiles hitting, you got pretty much insta-killed. Cramparinos here. Oh my god, this is great. And you're just lobbing chests at me all the time. What the hell's the uh, the one warranty card? I've not heard of that one before. Spawn the sewing machine, the sewing machine cha Ooh, okay. Twisted pair gets upgraded again. Nice. I don't even know what a doubly upgraded twisted pair even does for us, but I'll most certainly take it. Ooh, getting a bit of poison bombs in there too. Nice. And we got the Bob transformation. Wow. I can't even remember what the Bob transformation does. Does it does it give us explosion immunity? I feel like it maybe does. I can't remember. We do have a health up here, that's kinda nice. Yeah, so now we're leaving a lot of poison clouds as well as everything else. Quite nice, I have to say. A bit risky, a bit scary. Oh, you're still alive? Yeah, you scary bastard. I didn't realize there was one of them still alive. A another chest. Flatstone, I don't even know what that'll do. Probably nothing. It'd be funny if it made the missiles uh, bounce a bit. Oh my god. It's going crazy on those dudes. Okay. We've got a crawl space here. Nice. I did see also a gulp pill there. I will take that in case we find more trinkets. Hey, that's kind of nice for me, actually. That's just HP. I like that. Just simply more red HP is good for me. Okay. Oh, the room's over. That's one burn high. Starts unfilled, though, doesn't it? Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. Ooh, one minute, then. Maybe I've got a little idea here. Golden pill? I'm not really sure what I'm trying to get from this. Like a balls of steel, maybe?
Come on. Getting perks would be good in the boss fight, but I don't want to risk getting... Uh... I keep losing soul hearts here. HP up. Bad trip. So far, this hasn't been great. And needles. So far, we haven't gained much from this, I'll be honest. That's another bad trip. Are you a wizard? Another tears down. I'll never stop the. I'm excited. Gulp again. Look down again. Put us all the way back over here as well, which is just annoying. Shot speed down. Getting a lot of negatives here. Perks. Okay, it's gone. It's gone. Overall, not great, not terrible. I do have a little bit of an idea here that could help us, though. If we go down into here again, I think this is enough to charge this. Yes, it is. Good. Let me get another burn heart out of that. And then we can go back in here. At least we've got a lot of speed ups. We did lose a lot of fire air, though, which seemingly has helped us somehow. Oh, no, maybe not. Right. Lamb, I think you're going down pretty fast. Got have I grown up as well, which is kind of nice. I love the lamb's room. It looks so good. Oh my god. The split is inconvenient. They've split up quite a lot. one dead. Oh, that's two dead. There you go. No, thank you. No void there, so that doesn't matter. Let's go do Mega Satan and see how that goes. I guess we'll take this and do a bit more damage to him. I wonder if I'm excited is going to screw us over. Probably. Probably. Right, Mega Satan. Let's go. We do get a Holy Mantle in here. I forgot about that. Any boss fight. My god. The mini bosses, they're dying instantly. Even just the fires and poison are taking them out. I wonder why this guy spawns on his own. I guess it's because he could fill up a lot of the room. Potentially. That bomb seems to be taking forever to come down sometimes. Okay. Hand is moving into position. One hand is dead. To be fair, you're almost dead. Damn it, second angel. I was hoping that would actually kill the second angel as well, but didn't quite get there. Another hand dead, and you are dead. Okay, this should go really, really well. I haven't even been hit yet. Once he pops his little head up again. I will place my friend. No, it pushed him towards. It's okay, though. Look how much damage we just did. I think this is just breaking the, the damage cap. Well, break, like, like not not taking armor into account because it's just killing him so fast. No void, unfortunately, but what a good run. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.